Ho, ho, ho. Let's go. Greetings and welcome back to Chimo Chills. Let's start our December campaign. This is the Empire of the Claws. We are going for the extremely difficult and rare achievement of the Great Perm. Empire of the Claws. Okay, so there is a whole bunch of RNGs. Jesus, Jesus luck on how, how I do this opener exactly. It's not easy. I gotta... I have to hope if I, okay so in a perfect world Lithuania and Novgorod would both support my independence day one that would just be marvelous now is that going to happen is this a perfect world let's find out probably not mm -hmm. okay so you know that's not bad that's not bad 16 minus 16 and minus 20 that is not bad at all yeah okay all right I'll take that so, we're going to want to send a scornful insult as soon as we can. All right, let's 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 do the boring stuff. Let's jump into the estates first. Summon our diet. <laughs> Small ants will convert you up. I think that's the way to go. Do, do, do. We will enforce the religious unity and we will get you converting. 47 months, so be it. Now, I know I'm going to need to dev up one province, so I'll just might as well do it while I'm, while I'm in the screen, while I'm over here. We give away our three monthly mana points, absolutely. And then we sell our titles for that 187 ducats. Feels good. Finally, we seize land. And we are in the positive. Hey, we can harvest it one more time, bringing us up to 30 prestige. I like it. Now for the rest of them. Let's take a peek, peek. Uh, I'm not going to be at war with another <clears throat> religion right away. Maybe the Enforced re Unity of Faith. Get that extra religious conversion. Yeah, let's do that. And then just the ye old oversight of the clergy. Uh, you guys get supremacy. I'm going to go with the, the counselors for the cheaper advisor cost. It's probably the only cheaper advisor cost I'm going to get. Certainly for now at least. Um, and just free enterprise. Okay, that's a start. Now, let's jump back to Muscovy. We're going to send this insult. Scornful insult. It's going to make his enemies like me more. Well, that is good. <laughs> 55, and wow, we're not far away. We are, we're going for it, boys. We are going for it. Finally, let's grab a advisor. Ah, that's not great. I mean, I could get the morale guy, but that's so much. Land maintenance, so be it. So we'll have cheaper troops. And we have... Ooh, we have a cheap Diplo guy. Perfect. Okay, I will get him when we get closer to it. Alright, we're going to get the speed up slightly. And let's get time on... Oh, no, no. We're forgetting something. we got to build the force limit. We don't want to forget anything. This is good. This is a good opener. I like this. <laughs> You can you can hear I'm I'm getting hopeful here, and oh I, let's let's show off my two stud rulers six four five six five five hello don't even ask me how to pronounce it Permski that's what we're calling it. the Permski the Permski brothers are awesome we love the Permski brothers okay we are a subject of Muscovy in case you, you're not familiar with Great Perm and. Um, Oh, look at that. This is like the first couple weeks of the game. I get a random plus one. Hello. Uh, make sure I'm recording. Yes. <laughs> All right. That's a good opener. I, I will take a random plus one stab. Yes, please. That is that is very good. Now, I'm also going to just turn down the maintenance. I don't need to train at the moment. Yeah, we're just going to save up money. We're going to save up bank. And what am I doing? I need to get on Lithuania. Now they generally fall under... This is the, the perfect world. Lithuania does not fall under the Commonwealth. They ally me. We smack on Muscovy together. Everyone's happy. No Muscovy. I'm not, not taking your royal marriage. 
How close are we? Oh, man, that is so close. Come on, boys. You can do it. You can do it. I'm tempted to try to grab that diplomatic guy right now. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm doing that. Now we're going to go ahead. We're going to arm up. Oh, this is good. I'm, I'm, we're going to buy the free company. We're going all in on this. I'm going absolutely all in. We don't need to be in mock speed 5. And yes, yes, Lithuania's in. Novgorod's in. <laughs> He's up by a couple points. Now, when you bring your, your diplomat home, they get upset a tiny bit. All right, he's still good, and he's still good. Let's bring him home. I get my army moving to the front. Novgorod, buddy, yes, 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 yes. Lithuania, come on in. <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. I did a whole bunch of practice runs. I never got that to, to, to work like that. Not in one single one. Now, Lithuania can still get drawn on out by falling under the, 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 the personal union under Poland. If that happens, so be it. But I'm going to have my crack at this. We are going for our independence war. As soon as my, uh, my diplomat's home, I'm declaring it. <laughs> we have the numbers. We have the numbers. I just have to defend my capital. Let's do it, boys. Let's do it. In we go. Into the breach. Into the breach, yes. And our, they, they honored their alliance like we knew they would. Those leaders are good. Yeah, they're, they're good enough. They'll have to be good enough. I want to save up for the next military tech, so... Now, if, like, Novgorod's army would come over to me, that would be awesome, too. And get all linked up. Let's see what happens. For now, I'm just going to have my... Ooh, okay. Okay. We are going to build a couple more infantry. Because I don't know if I'm going to win this this battle right here. We're, we're going to see. I don't have full morale on my... Um, on my mercs there. So if, I, if I'm retreating... Oh, what's happening? What is this? What is this? What? What? A complete wipe? What? <laughs> all right, let's let's go all hail, hail Mary here. Um, wow. Oh, wow. All right, so everywhere I can build armies, we'll build armies. And if by some freak, you can see I'm stunned by that. You can see I'm just stunned by that. <laughs> if by some freak of nature, I'm able to rebuild an army and pull this off. Wow. Wow, I'm just stunned by that. I have to cancel that one army. That's something else. That's, that's pro... Pro game remove. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so the new strategy is we just defend our homeland. We defend our capital, and then when Novgorod peace is out, the war score will jump back down and we grab our independence at that point. Hopefully, in that time, Lithuania can actually siege down these two forts, maybe even Muscovy. That would be awesome. Get out of here, man. We will take that preach. Oh, minus 15 prestige for that authority, but so be it. And our best leader. That was that was the big oof, alright. That was the big oof. What is our force limit? We're at the force limit already. We're still building. Let's still build. I need more. I need more. Uh, we'll take some unrest. So be it. Is he gonna come? Come at me, bro. Come at me with, <laughs> with your four thousand. I'm not scared. Oh, he's got twelve. He's got the numbers on me. We weren't building there. We are building one here. Just one. 
Okay, so we'll cancel one. As soon as he's built, we're gonna flee into the forest here. Flee, you fool! Flee! Into the Pelham Forest as we just hide it out. What? Oh, he was. I thought he was gonna catch me. I'm like, no, no way. Get out of here with that nonsense. All right, we're just. We're literally just gonna hide. We have Moscow. Look at that. We have their capital. Yes! This could still work out, even with that ridiculous wipe against me. This could still work out. I, I may be even able to get my independence right this second without even losing... No, I can't! Without even losing Novgorod. Oh, wow. Okay, alright. So these would be the cheapest ones, so I, I can't take any. Um, do I think that Lithuania is going to take this fort? They're on two forts. They're not close to finishing either of them, is the thing. Um, well, you know what? I, let's get defensive on and we'll, we'll see what happens. As long as he's not going to take my capital, we're okay. Mm, does seem like he's running away, so I will jump on out. Be sneaky, sneaky. Seven percent. I like it. You can do this, boys. That that means they got the breach. That's why his army's running that way. Do it. You can do it, Lithuania. Believe in yourself. Oh, I really don't want him taking that capital. Get out of that mock speed five. Out of that madness. Um, okay. So what is going on here? Is he gonna win this? There's 13, so Novgorod should win that. This is good. This is a battle in our favor. We want that to happen. Oh, we took that other fort! We took that other fort! Yes! Yes! <laughs> okay, I gotta get you home. Right away. Alright, he has not taken anything more on me. So if I take this, how much do they not like me? 20? 20 distrust. So... That would give me or must uh, who has that? Um, whom would that be going to? Ustyag, 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 Ustyanta must be that one. No, Ustyag. So that wouldn't even go to me. So that's why. Okay. So I just take the piece because if I do this, then I have to give everyone else. Yeah. No, I don't have to give everyone. I would only have to give Lithuania. I wouldn't mind losing Novgorod. Or do I just take the piece? War rep makes him unhappy. The money they're okay with. Alright, we're gonna do that. Alright. Hey, we still have like a bunch of time left. And we're independent. And we have intact Novgorod and Lithuania, and, and Muscovy did not get a war off. That's pretty great. <laughs> yeah, Kazan, I, I I think you got to be my my rival there. Now, too bad I couldn't give anything to the both of them because if I if I could have, I would have had favors day one, and that would have obviously been fantastico. But all the same. We can start making favors with our two allies, and hopefully, 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 Lithuania does not go under... No, it doesn't look like... Um, is this a nuke? Lithuania did not... Wow. Wow, Lithuania did not fall under the Commonwealth. So that, that opening war didn't go perfect. Perfect would have been me taking this province, because it, it would complete the Perm state. And, and there's a mission in the mission tree, yeah. Um, where you build a fort and you have the whole whole state of Perm. So that would have been the perfect opening war. That wasn't perfect, perfect. And I had my stack wipe on me. Let's not forget that nonsense. That embarrassing nonsense. That is, that is now going to have to be aired. Because I actually succeeded in getting my independence. Yes, yes. Let's do this. This is the Empire of the Claws. Let's make it happen. So I am two over my limit. I got I to gotta get down to that. And we don't need to be supply limit of nine. That's where we're going to hide out with the army. And I also, I'm just going to have a normal... I, I love my rulers. I don't want them to die. I want them to live 
long. Uh, let's get on the capital. Let's convert that capital up. We don't need the defensiveness, so as soon as we can. Uh, halfway through the year. And Lithuania. Yes, Lithuania. We would love a royal marriage. Let's 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 secure these royal marriages. Oh, Novgorod's a republic, so we can't get a royal marriage with him. No problem. Lithuania is done. Now, who else might want to be our ally? Great Horde. Great Horde could happen. Who is Great Horde ally with? Biapes? Who the heck is Biapes? I don't care about them at all. And then finally, I want to get... I would think the improve relations. Just because I, I, I got to make sure that everyone loves me. I got to I gotta spend the, the, the time and effort on, on really making sure everyone loves me. The Peasants War, manpower 50%, currently in a disaster. That should go down, I believe. And we're training. Oh no, that is a looming disaster. What do I have to do? It's just manpower? There's no block? Like, I can't get myself to positive? That seems suspicious. What's going on here? Come on, Peasants War. I, I'm not going to be at 50% manpower for a while here. That's not fair. Hmm. Well, it is what it is. Ah, there it goes. It went away. It went away. I don't know what blocked it. It, it must be the positive stab. Why doesn't it tell me that? I... I feel like it should tell me that. Ah, ba -doo -ba -doo. We can use that again in a couple years. Yeah, let's just mock speed 5 it a bit. We got some time to go. It would be awesome if we get this war off with Kazan. It would, it would be all about getting the, the favors with... Who's going to be closest? Litho They're both. They're both like the same distance away from, from Kazan. All right, so we'll get him. Oh, I don't. I don't want to spend. I don't want to spend my prestige. Sorry, I don't like either of those, but I, I really don't want to spend my prestige. And I am still losing money. Why am I still losing money a turn? Oh, oh, I have two advisors still. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're going to get rid of both my advisors because I have to start paying off these loans. I have eight loans like a ridiculous man. I shouldn't be training you. You should be, um, let's, let's pay attention. I was so amazed that I actually won that war that I just kind of lost my mind for a moment there. Now, with these points I have... I could actually no no we're gonna we're gonna save for this for the first level we just gotta pay our loans let things recover. Oof. Um. Nope. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! So we're just getting negative multipliers. So more unrest. More unrest. It's okay. We'll get that capital converted up and and things will calm down. Let's well, no longer tangry. And it looks like we're first in the world for the level four tech. Uh, military tech. Could have used that. <laughs> Could have used that before I got wiped by Moscow, but it'll come in handy against Kazan. Okay, so here's our revolt. I should have been should have been on top of that a bit more. At least it's on the fort. And we also want to get our ally with Great Horde. We should get favors with Lithuania. What? What are you talking about? Okay, back to improve relations. They do that. Sometimes it'll show, and you'll pull your, your diplomat away, and they, they won't like that. They'll be like, no, I don't approve of this, man. Uh, let's just wait. The I, I This month, it should happen, or I have no clue what I'm talking about. It, it went the other way. I have no clue what I'm talking about. We, we will cur curry favors with, with Lithuania. Now, Novgorod, how are we doing? We're, we're almost at 10 with you, too. I get both these boys in on this war. Hmm. Is our force limit? We're gonna have to just send them in. They seem to be losing manpower. Now, how good would this ruler be? Um, it should show me. Should, oh, they just want—they just want privileges. It's not a new ruler. They're not—they're not looking to impose a new ruler. We'll get the uh, the better of my two generals. Oh, they, they could have won that. 
They could have won that. I, I, I really did leave that to the very last moment. Mm -hmm. I'm going to turn the maintenance down just enough that they'll still replenish troops, but... I, uh... And we'll allow Great Horde to get... But but where I'm not paying for it. I'm still making money. I can pay off these <laughs> these loans that I should have had at least one more of paid off. Ooh, a general with 100 tradition. I'll take that. It's a hit. It's a hit on prestige and um and my legitimacy. I don't want, but hey, I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to get greedy. Let's take a peek. I didn't even look. Hey, not bad. 5521. Five, not bad at all. I... Welcome on board. Welcome aboard. I can't use you at the moment, but I will get around to doing so. And then we're going to get right on to just improving relations with Novgorod. It looks like they're going up pretty fast. Like, they're they're higher than Lithuania, and I'm not creating favors with them. I don't know why that is, but I'm not going to argue it. Hmm. Loans are just loans. Whatever. I sh actually, I should get the cheaper loans, though. Shouldn't be silly. Or do I already have the cheaper loans? <laughs> do I already have the cheaper loans? What's going on here? Oh, that's the uh, the burger. Silly. Yeah, I'm not even... What am I doing? I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's get the expansion zealot tree on there. I actually do want that, and I can seize land again. So stab three, Nojai's opinion a hundred, or Ustvin production three. Nojai. That wouldn't be too hard to do. What does that get me? It it it, it takes up a, a no. I'll, I'll just go with the the production, though I don't want to spend production in a random province at all, like in the slightest. But so be it. It'll happen. It will happen. We're going to get to the advancement, and then we'll jump over here. Religious, and we are already converting. That'll be our last province we have to convert to. And we're getting close. You got this, Novgorod. <laughs> we're at 10. We're already at 10 with Novgorod. So if we were to attack Kazan, Novgorod does not seem into it. They're not feeling this. No, no, God. Transfer trade power. Why would I transfer my trade to you, dude? Not, not even considering that. That's uh, that. This is the worst deal in the history of deals, and I'm uh, a no. That's not happening. Mm -hmm. No, what happened? We didn't. Oh, we didn't even get you as an ally. Oh, we just maxed out on the improved relations, and for some reason it. Okay, we have to, we have to send the um, the diplo insult on Kazan. I gotta be I gotta be more proactive on that. I kind of brain farted. I was like, wow, this is taking a, a a long time. Boom, boom, boom. So our new king. One second, let's just slow this up. We'll send the scornful insult. I don't have positive prestige. That's the big oof. That's the big oof. That's frustrating. All right, well, I'll take the little bit of uh, power projection I can get, but I can't harvest more prestige here. All right. Now, who are you actually at war with? Kirkasia, Georgia. It's a warrior winning. No, you got to stay on there. Great horde. You, how don't you love me? We have we have mutual enemies. Like this, just we're a natural fit, you and me, Great Horde. A natural fit. We both don't like Kazan. And, and together we could smash Kazan. It doesn't appear that I can do it without you. Well, and we know there's going to be another war, uh, another round on Muscovy. So even if I am kind of blocked for a little bit, so I can get my, my alliance with Great Horde, which he has no allies at all. Like, Great Horde, you, have, you are surrounded by enemies, man. I'm offering you the hand of friendship. And he's just... Smacking it away. Great horde. You gotta come to your senses. Come to your sources. Senses. Uh, I didn't jump into those. Oh, my Aeris 333. Three, three. That's not terrible, but it's not this 655. Five. I hope this... Let him live to to 100. I don't think I've ever had a ruler live to 100. Let this king right here live to 100. That's what 
That, that is my request to the uh, RA Jesus gods. I could hire the diplomatic guy again. Yeah, that, that'd probably get him. <laughs> so once we have our country converted up, we lose that privilege. And I can jump in here. And I can grab... No, that's burgers. I am brain farting hard. I, I, I keep mistaking the two of them. No, I don't think I want any of these, actually. Patriarchal authority is not bad. Yeah, patriarchal authority is pretty good. We're just going to leave that empty for now. <laughs> and will we start deving? We're at... I'm tempted to start deving feudalism. Like, we're already taking a 15% hit. I am. I'm going to begin the deving of feudalism. So with all of our, our Diplo and admin points, it's all going to be spent on that capital. Well, uh, well, well, our ducats do one thing. Pay our loans off. Pay our independence war loans off. Yeah, it's going to have to happen. It seems that they just, they won't, they won't do it. They won't do it unless I, uh, I hire that Diplo guy. Or, or, or maybe I build a bigger army. They, they finally, hey, they noticed me finally. I don't know what changed. They finally noticed me and get back before the end of the month so they can change their mind. Yay. Oh, he's got a whole bunch of, bunch of allies now. How good does that feel? And the Great Horde will join me. Ooh. Oh, how good is that? You know what the thing here is, too? I attack... I attack Kazan. St bear with me for a second. <laughs> bear with me. I attack Kazan. I call on the Great Horde. Crimea joins. <gasps> Lithuania will join after I start the war because Crimea will be in. I am almost sure of that. I don't need to co-belligerent Cry Crimea for them to join. Once Lithuania sees... I believe I'll be able to call them in. That is my belief. Though I can't... Oh, while they're fighting in a war, they may not do it without the promise of land. So I would have to do one big peace treaty and make sure that Lithuania got land. That would be the only thing out of that. But that's that's doable. That's do. Wow, this is... What a great first episode. I, am, I wasn't even going <laughs> to attempt to record this tonight. I am really glad that I did. Thank you very much for t for making it to the end. What do you think of the Empire of the Claws? This will be our December campaign. Let it snow. Let it snow. Until then, you have a great day. Happy holidays. Goodbye.